So this is my breeding tank after uh, getting it all fixed and everything. I had a uh, an outbreak of columnaris a few weeks ago and uh, as you can see I got that fixed. Everyone's nice and healthy. Uh, there was a small problem where one of the males gave into a hexameter, which by the way pretty much every fish has some case of this. Uh, comes with, you know, being bought in pet stores where they cycle all the filters together like PetSmart and Petco and Walmart, you know, though technically Walmart isn't a pet store. Pet store in most places have a banned fish from them, but yeah, so Hexameda, as you can see, this male right here has a prolapsed rectum. Part of his uh, intestine has come outside of his body, and he's been going for a good, you know, two or three weeks like this, so I'm kind of hoping he'll just fix it naturally. I may add some Epsom salt at a later date if it doesn't fix itself. But everyone else has been uh, pretty good about it. Uh, Hexameda is an internal parasite, and uh, there, there's pretty much very few ways known to fix it. Uh, one of them that I've had fairly good track record with is by adding a liquid fertilizer to the water, because this adds uh, the nutrients like magnesium and calcium that the parasite pretty much leeches out of the fish and if you notice your fish eating eating has quite an appetite but it seems to be wasting away and losing weight that's one indicator another one is uh, when they have white feces like a clearish white stringiness coming out of them that's another great indicator of it also prolapsed rectum just so you know